got another mail loader and uh, it's a special one. He did a, a request I haven't done for a while. So we got some uh, full quill ostrich. Um, I will be using super fine leather with a uh, good old Vibro. Now on this particular model, um, he requested a hybrid. So we're gonna convert this uh, with a full leather sole uh, with a new rubber heel cap. And we're gonna do the hybrid sole and um, see how the chunky the, uh, the stack leather bases are. So we're gonna reduce them. We're gonna take some, some of this down, narrow it down so they don't look that clunky. So it sticks out like that instead of a little more. So he requested he wanted a little bit of a pitch in. So we're pretty much gonna be reducing them down to not much, but you know, to fit this one. You can see the difference on the outside. Okay, so let's get the show started.
Okay, so I got the hybrid soles all finished, and here is the finished product. I think they came out awesome. Now, I talk about the uh, heel bases, what I was gonna do, I was gonna trim them down just a slight amount. I did about eight, eight you know, 16 to one eighth of an inch all the way around. And then on the back, I give it just a little slang. Now they got some uh, some detail to them. Now they look awesome. Before they were just too clunky. So I ended up, uh, like I said, you know, trimming them down around just a small amount. And uh, also the uh, the back, just a, you know, a small portion. Uh, and on the upper, I did use Cadillac Boot Shoe Leather Lotion with some uh, Meltonian. And then at the end, I used some uh, uh, neutral uh, Lincoln Wax just a small portion just to kind of give it a gloss and what that does is also kind of shields it I mean the Cadillac already waterproofs them but if you wear them out in the rain or you're out and about with your buddies or your wife girlfriend and you drop drink on them um, that'll repel it um, it gives you at least time to just kind of wipe whatever you drop on there um, because the uh, Cadillac and Boucher leather lotion has a little bit of uh, waterproofing and also the uh, the uh, small portion that I use uh, Lincoln wax but um, yeah, before that, if, you know, if you're gonna be using wax before that, you wanna, you know, coat them with a conditioner, um, and then the, the wax will be at the end if you like look, your boots a little bit of glossy. But uh, it also does help, like I said, you know, uh, repel some of the uh, fluid that gets dropped on there by mistake. So I just wanna thank you again for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Um, I really appreciate it. Um, one, one last look. All right, let's do the other one. Got the heel, looking awesome. Man, I, them heels just came out really good. I, I, I really like the way they came out. On the bottom, thank you for uh, for all your comments. Um, also, whether they're good or bad, um, it still it still helps. You know, you're still a fan. You know, by watching my videos, you know, if you're watching, hey, that helps a lot. Um, it helps my business grow, and it helps me where. The destination where I'm going, um, I have a lot of plans, like I said, and uh, one day, uh, one of this, I'm gonna share uh, what's on my mind. Uh, but other than that, I mean, thank you, uh, thank you again. Um, I don't think I can say thank you enough. <laughs> you know, really, does, you know, it really does help. You know, by you watching or or melting your boots. You know, all the small little projects that I do, I know they also do help quite a bit. Um, but I think um, I think I said enough. Um, and um, enjoy the rest of the video. Till next time. Bye, y'all.